an awesome control and way to get into the shoulder clamp position is to swim the arms, bring the shoulders down, create a gable grip and pass your arm over the shoulder to create the shoulder clamp position in the close guard and then start attacking from there. An awesome attack you can use from the shoulder clamp position is an arm crush attack. Once we have the shoulder clamp, we then shimmy out to one side, maneuvering closer, trapping the wrist between the head and shoulder, and then applying pressure downwards on the elbow to achieve a powerful submission. Another awesome attacking option from the shoulder clamp position is an arm drag to the back. This time, shimming out to the side, we use the same side grip to pull the arm across and reposition to the back. Another great option of attack in the shoulder clamp position is a triangle. Sometimes when the triangle is defended, we can also enter a Barato Plata shoulder submission. When our opponent defends by putting their wrist on the inside of the triangle, we make a grip on the inside of the arm, feeding our arm through, gripping our own thigh and stepping over the head pressuring down on the shoulder, twisting and attacking the shoulder joint for a strong submission. There are many great attacking options in the shoulder clamp position. Another great attack from the guarded position is a Kimura or reverse Kimura option. Again, when we get out to one side with the shoulder clamp and instead of being able to attack the elbow, our partner twists their arm, bends, the, bends their arm and allows the shoulder submission instead, gripping the wrist with either the bottom or top arm to create pressure for a submission. Another great option to attack the shoulder is the omoplata. Again, when our opponent defends by bending their arm, we're able to reposition our legs and attack the shoulder joint with an omoplata submission hold. Another awesome submission that we can hit from the shoulder clamp position is a rolling arm bar. Again, repositioning our legs to have even more power in attacking the elbow. We shimmy out to one side. As the arm straightened out, we're gonna post up onto one arm and throw our hips into position, rolling and entering a strong arm bar attack. Another awesome attack from the shoulder clamp position is a sumigeshi sweep, where 
we shimmy out to one side, we clamp on the shoulder, but this time we reposition one of our legs to make a butterfly hook. We we'll use the butterfly hook to elevate our partner, we chop on the outside leg, and we land on top from our sweep attack. Again, another very powerful attacking option from the shoulder clamp position is a triangle choke. Again, locking the triangle in the neck and shoulder squeezing with a powerful finish. We shimmy out to one side. We use our leg to beat the bicep and shoulder. We lock the triangle and finish with a very powerful choke. <laughs> 